Hey, miss. I think you dropped this notebook. Oh, this isn't mine. Oh, sorry. I have to get going now. Okay. Where did that notebook come from? Um, that little old lady just gave it to me and ran off, so I guess it's mine now. There's nothing written in it. Maybe you should use it to manifest something. <laughs> like what? You can get Mark to like you back. Fine. Mark is in love with me. Oh, well, would you look at that? Nothing happened. Um, who was that? Did you invite someone over here? No, I didn't. I swear. Okay. Hello? Mark? Hey, Bailey. Um, I'm in love with you. Whoa, what? Would you want to go on a date with me tonight? Uh, yeah, yeah, I would love to. Great. I'll pick you up at seven. Hmm? Sis? Why do you look shook? The journal works. <laughs> what do you mean? That was Mark telling me he loves me. What? Guys, I just found the cutest guy on Tinder. Ooh, let me see, girl. Yeah, look. Um, that's definitely a catfish. What? That's not a real person. He's fake. No, he's not fake. He's been texting me. It looks like he got those photos off Google Images. No, it does not. He's just pretty. You need to block that account right now. We don't know who it is. What if I want to talk to him? I'm advising you not to. Ugh, whatever. You're probably wrong. Look, he wants to meet up for dinner in a public place. It's fine. I swear you are so dumb. Hey, I'm heading out. No, just stay in with me. Please stop it. I'm going anyway. You're just jealous. <laughs> he should be here soon. Oh, uh, excuse me, miss. Hmm? Bailey, it's so nice to meet you. I'm sorry, do I know you? It's me, Jake, from Tinder. No, you're not. I am. But you're... Honey, your locket came in the mail today. What? Give it to me. <sighs> this is great. I mean, who do you think it is? I honestly have no clue who could be inside. Well, stop stalling then and open it. Okay, okay. So? <gasps> Well, it is someone I definitely know. Who is it? Tell me! Marshall. Marshall as in the one with a girlfriend of six years? Mm-hmm. You have to tell him. I know. Hey, Marshall, I got my locket today. That's awesome, finally. Yeah, well, I have something to tell you. I have something to tell you, too. You first. So, after last night, me and Macy are engaged. Engaged? Like, gonna be married. Um, yeah, that's what engage means. Just double-checking. What was it that you wanted to tell me? Um, it's nothing, really. Please don't be something that I use all the time. Oh, that's so much worse. Okay. So did you get your forbidden word? Yep. Well, what is it? It's my own name. Wow, that really sucks. Oh, thanks. You're so helpful. Um, you might want to look at what time it is right now. Oh my god, I'm going to be so late. I gotta go. Bye. Hi, sorry, I know I'm late. Your transfer student's waiting for you. Yeah, where is she? They're actually a he this year. What? Oh, here he is. Ew, you're my guide. Um, excuse me? No offense, you just look kind of dumb. Why are you being mean? I literally just met you. I'm not being mean, bro. I'm just spitting facts. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Should we get on with the tour now? Whatever. Great. Wait, what even is your name? It's Chad. Of course it's Chad. What's yours? My name is... Bella. So, this is the cafeteria. Whatever. Where do the cool people sit? The cool people? I hang with the popular crowd. They're definitely not gonna like you. Which classrooms don't have security cameras? Why? In case I find a MILF teacher. Ew. Uh, you know I'm just kidding. Yeah, right. Ba Shh. Why did you shush me? Bella. My name is Bella. Um, okay. Okay, our tour is done now. You can go. Wait, what if I want to be your friend? Why would you want to be my friend? I, I don't know. You seem cool. Yeah, I'm going to have to pass. I mean, it seems like people like you, so... You think I'm cool, so now you want to be my friend? Yep, exactly. You are so weird. So, what do you say? No. Wrong answer. No. I'll tell them you're a terrible tour guide. You wouldn't. Oh, trust me, I would. Fine, whatever. Please don't be far, I'm really fucking lazy. Oh, good. 
Hey, sis, please don't be annoying. My boyfriend's coming over. You know what? I think I will be. You won't think that's funny when I punch you in the face. Whatever. He's gonna be here soon. Uh, how far away is he? I don't know, like three miles. Why? No reason. Maybe it's just a coincidence. Everyone, Rose is my soulmate. Uh, no, I'm not. My soulmate's seven miles away. Oh, look at the time. I gotta get going to school. Bye, guys. Um, are you okay? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because you were eating your finger. I wasn't. Tell me what's wrong. <sighs> okay. I think my sister's boyfriend is my soulmate. What? Are you sure? I'm like 99.8% sure. What are you gonna do? I don't know. I can't break them up. Bailey, we need to talk. I have to pee. You must have had fun last night with that new tattoo. What? What tattoo? Um, the one on your collarbone? I don't have a ta- <gasps> Where the fuck did that come from? You didn't know it was there? No! I feel like I would remember getting a tattoo. You better pray that it's fake for mom's sake. <laughs> it's definitely real. What does it even say? Um, it says live your dream. That's cute, but why the fuck is it there? Couldn't tell you. Don't let mom see it, though. Ugh. Hey, Brooke. <laughs> oh, hey. When did you get that tattoo? I don't know. I woke up this morning and it was just there. Okay, um, because... Me too. Mine says beware. Like, beware of what? That's a little bit worse than mine, but where did these come from? I didn't even black out last night. Nice tattoo. Um, thanks, Jack. It's just kind of crazy because, uh, I have the same exact one. Hey, guys, I'll be reading the will of your father. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you. For Michelle, he left a million dollars in a beachfront home. Wow! That's amazing. And for Bailey, all he left was a ring. What? That can't be. He left me a ring? Honestly, that makes sense. I was always dad's favorite. Great. At least it's my favorite color. Hey, I have some bad news. What is it? My dad's already dead. I think that Jackson may have cheated on you. Huh? I just, like, heard some rumors about it. I don't know if it's true. Are you sure? Um, yeah, I'm sure. What are you talking about? Hey, I'm so sorry about your dad. Thank you. It's okay. He died of natural causes, right? Yeah, it was natural causes. Oh, that's so sad. I am super sorry. Hey, um, isn't that guy over there your ex-boyfriend? Yes. Why is he at our school? He doesn't even go here. Maybe he's just dropping someone off. Everyone, please welcome our new student, Ryan. No. Is it a bad thing? You still talk to your exes. That's the problem. He's my only ex that I don't still talk to. Oh, what happened between you guys then? I don't want to bring it up. Oh, Bailey. It's uh, funny to see you here, huh? You know that I go here. Why are you at our school? I had to transfer schools because of my parents' divorce. Whatever, just don't bother me. Wait, I just wanted a second chance with you. You broke my heart. <laughs> hey, do you want a piece of gum? Oh, sure, thanks. Hey, would you want to go on a date with me tonight? What? I just think you're beautiful. You literally hate me. What? No, definitely not. Why are you sitting there? What do you mean? Get up and go somewhere else. I always sit here. We're best friends. Yeah, definitely not anymore. You're delusional. What the fuck is going on? On behalf of the entire football team, we would like to perform a song for Bailey. Uh, why did the entire football team just serenade you? You know, I really wish I could answer that, but I'm not sure myself. How's that gum tasting? Um, it just tastes like gum. Why? I was just checking to see if you felt different. What? Uh, nothing. Never mind. Bye! <laughs> Girl, you better spit out that gum. It makes everyone who hates you love you, and everyone who loves you hate you. Huh? Okay, there has to be at least, like, one person that likes me, right? I stand corrected. Am I, like, ugly or something? So, how many people like you? Zero. Well, that doesn't really surprise me. What's that supposed to mean? You're kind of a bitch. I am not. You know, it costs nothing to be a good person. Being a bitch is also free. 
Hey, I'm new. Can I sit here? Ew, no. Girl, you're literally being feral. That's not true. I'm gonna sit down anyway, okay? Excuse you? This is the only seat that's open right now. I just told you, you can't. Whoa, I'm so scared of you, Pinkie Pie. So, uh, what's your name? None of your business. Weird, but I think we're gonna get along. I don't think we will. Why are you so fucking bitter? I'm not bitter. Well, you're definitely not pleasant. Oh, hey, uh, good morning. You again? Um, yeah, this is my seat now. Go kick rocks. Okay, I'm gonna kick them at you. Excuse you? Why don't you try being nice? And why don't you try backing off? That's not in my vocabulary. Could you at least say, like, one nice thing? Mm, let me think about it. No. Um, anyway, my name is Matthias. Okay, well, I didn't ask you, Matt. My name is Matthias, not Matt. Mm, I'm gonna call you Matt instead. I can see why no one has a crush on you. How did you know that? Lucky guess. I mean, it's pretty obvious. <laughs> People like me. Really? Because you were sitting by yourself until uh I came. Ah, right. I have an idea. What? You should come on a date with me tonight. With that receding hairline? No. Come on, it'll be fun. Uh, fine, if you'll stop bugging me. Good morning, sweetheart. Do I know you? Honey, what are you talking about? Are you okay? I'm your mom. No, you're not. I've never met you before. You've literally seen me every day of your life. Where am I? This is not a funny joke anymore. I'm not kidding. Whatever, we need to get to school. You're gonna be late. Okay. Wait, bestie, where are you going? You always sit next to me. I don't know you, sorry. Bitch, what? I'm your best friend. Doesn't ring a bell. Ryan, you need to check on your girlfriend. Something is wrong with her. Hey, babe, how are you? Babe? Yeah, I uh, always call you babe. You're my girlfriend. You're my boyfriend? But we're in love. You don't remember me? No. What happened to that party? What party? The one you apparently lost your memory at. Okay, the rumor can't be that bad. I feel like everyone likes me. What? I think I'm hallucinating. Who said that? I'm gonna find out who said that about me and I'm gonna... No. Hmm. Fuck you! Ugh, holy... Stacy, what is going on here? Everyone's fighting because of the rumors that were released today. Oh. They're all just blaming each other and then fighting about it. I mean, that's fair. Have you seen mine? Okay, but like, yours is true. What are you talking about? You were definitely the reason that they broke up. No, I wasn't. I barely even spoke to him. Yeah, but he liked you more. He what? That's why she doesn't talk to you anymore. She saw his text messages. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. You ho! Ow! You're such a bitch. Why would you say that about me? Excuse you? I hope I get some good choices. Uh, um... A million dollars or sunglasses? You couldn't have made this easier. Hey, is that my shirt? You dumb hoe. Oh, were you selecting something? You just made me pick the wrong option. I could have had a million dollars. Oh, look at the time. I gotta get to school. See ya. Uh, oh, good. They're ugly, too. <clears throat> hey, honey. What did you end up picking? I don't want to talk about it. Gotta go. I'm going to buy a yacht with my million dollars. What about you? Could you guys, like, talk about this somewhere else? I mean, I guess so. Why? Because I didn't get a million dollars. Ew, why would you pick those? I didn't do it on purpose. Just so you know, I'm not giving you any money. Ugh. They're just normal glass. What, are they, like, magic or something? You have a crush on me? What? No, I don't. What are you talking about? Are you sure you don't have a crush on me? Yes, I'm sure. We're just friends. Why? No, just making sure. What the fuck? Tracy, can I try something on you? Sure, I guess. Great, thanks. What are you doing with those ugly glasses? You've been sleeping with my brother? What? He told you? I told you not to talk to him. But how did you know that? My glasses told me. So, are you messing with me? No, I'm not kidding. 
and we're not friends anymore. Good morning, class. Please put away your phones. Let's see what you're hiding. Bailey, your phone's still on your desk. <laughs> Are you okay? Could I go to the nurse? Go ahead. Okay. Hey, um, are you doing okay? No, I'm on my way to the nurse. Why? What's wrong? I think that there's something's like wrong with me. If you're talking about the glasses, nothing's wrong with you. I have them too. What are you talking about? There's nothing weird about my glasses. Why are you lying to me? I'm not lying. Then why do you look like you need to use the bathroom? Hey. So, are you gonna admit it now? Fine, well then what do you want? I want you to work together with me. What? I'm guessing you didn't want the glasses either? No, it was an accident. Same here. My glasses make people tell the truth. We could be so rich if you did this with me. How would we make money? We can get people's secrets and then we can sell them off to people. I don't know about that. Why not? It's a good plan. Sounds kind of bad. Everyone does bad things sometimes. Not me. So, what do you say? No. If you don't work with me, I'm gonna tell everyone about your glasses. Oh, so you're gonna blackmail me now? Yeah, so maybe you'll change your mind now. No. Hey, everyone, baby. Shh, fine, okay. Hey, is the seat taken? Oh, no, it's not. Go ahead. Are you just sitting here by yourself? Well, I was waiting for my friends, but it kind of looks like they ditched me. Well, I can be your friend if that helps. Thanks. Thanks for your number. It was so nice to meet you. Yeah, it was so nice to meet you, too. I totally forgot about that. At least he's tall. Bitch, I met the cutest guy at the country club this morning. Oh, my gosh. Really? Where did you find him? No, he just came up and started talking to me. I was like, hey, everyone, I'm Mr. Nichols. I'll be your new teacher this year. Is something wrong? No, huh? Dude, it's always the English teachers. Why is he kind of cute? Yeah, I guess. So, about the guy? The who, what, what? Um, the guy, yeah, he was super cute. Oh, okay. Oh, boy. Hey, ladies. Huh. Hi. Hi! Hey, good morning. Did you get another tattoo? No, what are you talking about? Uh, look at your arm. <gasps> what the fuck is that? It's a little dino. You must have had a fun night. I was literally sober last night. That's not possible. Mom's gonna kill me. She told me not to get any more tattoos, and I didn't even know that I got this one. How do you not remember? You look different today. Different how? I don't know. Something's just off. Okay. Here are your tests. Bailey, I need to see you after class. Why? You got a 12%. What? What is going on today? I wake up with a fucking dino on my arm, and now everything's going wrong. Girl, I wish I could tell you. Ugh. Guys, I think I just met my soulmate. Soulmates aren't real. Tell that to the tattoo on your arm. What? It's a matching one with your soulmate. Why is someone just telling me this now? Each tattoo has a different meaning, but I guess yours didn't pick a good one. That bitch. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry. We don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your co-workers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure, I don't think so. 
I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Uh, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? Wait, how do you know my first name? I don't think I ever told you that. I know where I know you from now. Well, where is it? Don't leave me hanging. Huh? <gasps> Wait! That was you? You're my favorite customer. I can't believe you didn't remember me. I mean, two years is a pretty long time. You said you could never forget. Usually, I don't forget seeing beautiful faces. I don't know why I did. We have to catch up. Are you free for dinner later? Yeah, I'm free for dinner. Okay, great. I'll text you all of the details. How do I look, Mom? You look beautiful, honey. Good luck on your first date. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, how can I help you tonight? Oh, yeah, just a table for two, please. Whatever, he's obviously not showing up. I'm just gonna go home. Well, I might as well get myself some food on the way home. Alone. Hello? Um, is anyone here? I could have sworn it said that they were open on their website. How can I help you? Lucas? That's my name. I'm glad you made it here. Why are you here? I wanted to surprise you at the place we first met. So you let me sit at that restaurant alone for two hours? Uh, what? I, uh... I don't know. I just wanted to surprise you, I guess. What if I didn't show up here? What if I just went home? I'm so sorry. I didn't think about it like that. I'm going home. See you tomorrow. Bailey, I think I'm in love with you. What? What are you talking about? It's just something about you. I feel like I'm in love. I mean, how? We've only spoken like a couple times. I never stopped thinking about you after the day we met. I don't know, I mean... Let me make it up to you. Just give me one more chance. Okay, but this is your last one. Okay, I totally understand that. Hi everyone, we have one more new employee this year, Tate. Are you okay? Um, is something wrong? Um, no, nothing's wrong. So, can I pick you up at 8 tonight for the date? Yeah, yeah. That's a wrap for this week. Everybody enjoy your weekend. Hey, wait! Uh, my name's Tate. I think I know you. I'm sorry, I don't think I know you. I have to get going. Are you serious right now? Sorry. Honey, are you really going on a second date with him? Yeah, what do you mean? I saw how upset you were. Just be careful. Okay. Wow, you look even more stunning than usual. Thank you. I'm really sorry about the first date. I did not mean to. You know what? It's okay. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I never went there again. Funny seeing you guys here. Tate? Sorry for just showing up like this, but I have something to say. Bailey, we were in love in high school. Don't act like you forgot about me. What? It, is that true? Wait, but you told me you had no idea who he was. I just didn't want to remember him. So, you're just gonna lie to me about it then, huh? You abandoned me. That is not the same thing. Yes, it is. And honestly, I think this date is over too. Wait, but I thought that- Don't. <sighs> Work is gonna suck today. Oh, uh, hey, good morning, Bailey. Hey, Tate. Where did this dum-dum come from? I'm not sure. It was just on your desk when I got here. Are you okay? You look a little stunned. No, I'm good. Looks like he didn't even bother showing up to work today. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, good morning, Bailey. Good morning, Tate. How are you doing? Why do lollipops keep appearing on your desk every day? Yeah, uh, I don't know. 
Orange is the worst flavor. At least leave a good one. Enough. It probably was just an accident. Looks like your man didn't show up today either. He's just a coward. Another one? Give me that. No. Why not? Why are you being protective? No reason. I just really like them. I wanted to ask if you would go on a date with me. A date? Yeah, like dinner or something. Why wouldn't you? You literally ruined my last date. Uh, that's not true. <laughs> I just- Can I have everyone's attention? My dad owns a large lollipop company. We're trying to find someone to make the best new flavor. Is something wrong? No. Ooh, I'm gonna make a chili cheese fries lollipop. That sounds gross. I thought it was a good idea. Sorry. Uh, hey Bailey. Bro, fuck off. Tate, don't. Well, I was just trying to help you. Well, it's not helpful, okay? Do you have any ideas for the contest? Nope, I don't. Really, you don't have a single idea at all? No, I mean it, and I don't want to talk to you, so please, just stop. I mean, are you sure you really should- Ow! You just punched him in the face. He was bothering you. What? I thought that he was bothering you. Yeah, that doesn't mean that you punch him. So I assume this means you don't want to go on a date anymore? No, definitely not. Could both of you please just leave me alone? Wait, just one thing. What, Lucas? Here. I know it's your favorite. Thanks. Excuse me. Yes? Are you Bailey by any chance? Yeah, that's me. Congratulations, you won the contest for the best new flavor. Wait, what? Your entry was chosen to be the winner. But I didn't even enter a flavor. Um, I don't know, there's just one listed under your name. The prize fund is a million dollars, congrats! Huh? Please don't be someone I already know, I can't deal with that. No! Please, not him! Anyone but him! So, did you find out your soulmate results yet? Don't ask me about it. Oh. You'll never guess who my soulmate is? Mark? Yeah. Yeah, I knew it. You two have been in love since like sixth grade. Yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> but what about you? Who's your soulmate? Knowing you, it's gonna be like Chandler or something. How did you know? I was just kidding. <sighs> you seriously cannot avoid him forever. Yes, I can, and I plan on it. Let him explain himself. Bailey, wait. Nope. Yo. What? Did you get your results today? Yeah, I did. Well, happy birthday, but, uh, I'm assuming you know we're soulmates. I don't want to be your soulmate, or really even your friend, so don't talk to me. What? But the system. I don't care. Um, okay, it's a little early for that, but no judgment. Oh, I did not need to know that. Oh, okay. Ooh, now I have an image in my... Uh. Better not be my school. Hey, guys. Hey, are you okay? No, my soulmate is so weird. Uh, okay, what did he do? You don't want to know. Dude, take a fucking break. What is it now? Never mind. Oh, Bailey. Whoa, hey, what's wrong with you? I need to tell you something. Uh, what do you have to tell me? I've been holding this back for a while, but I have feelings for you. Uh, no you don't. <laughs> what do you mean? Yes, I do. I like you. You don't like me. No, no. No. <laughs> Bro, yes, mm -mm. I do. I can't believe you don't like me. No, don't cry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. No, it's too late now. Oh, hey, Bailey. Good morning. Hey. I'm not ready for this test. Where did these come from? Uh, I don't know. I didn't put them there. They were just sitting on my desk. Maybe you have a secret admirer. Right, that's funny. <laughs> you, uh, you tired? <sighs> yeah, I didn't get much sleep last night. Another? If you're doing this, just tell me now. I'm serious. It's not me. Is there a note? No, they didn't leave anything with it. It's just earrings. I mean, that's kind of weird. And there it is. Hair clips this time. If they want to give you free things, let them. I'm not complaining. We have to be here early for a meeting tomorrow, remember? Yeah, I know. I'll be there. Everyone, please have a seat. 
Did Emily just put something on my desk? Okay, are you ready to see what color you got? Yes, I hope I'm just a civilian. There is no way you'll be a criminal. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Big reveal. Three, two, one. Oh shit, that's not good. What? Uh, here's a mirror. <gasps> you better go put on the most high coverage concealer you have. Okay, I will. Whatever you do, don't tell anyone that you have a red mark. I got it. Oh, finally you're here. Oh, hey. I don't have my mark yet. Did anything come for you? No, nothing showed up. Imagine if one of us actually had a red mark. That would be <laughs> so bad. You're so funny. Amber got caught putting a red mark on her face this morning. That's weird. Why would you want to be a criminal? I don't know, but they're going to find her out during the mark check. During the whom and a what -a? Well, they have to check everyone's mark to make sure. Are you hiding something? Nope. I can't wait to find out who's lying during the mark check. Why do you look like that? What? Are you good? You're acting so weird. No, I told you. I'm fine. Oh, looks like I'm up next for the mark check. Have fun. Excuse you. Oh, I am so sorry. Your mark is red. I know, but I'm not dangerous. No one believes me. Do you? No, I believe you. My name's Casey. Nice to meet you. Bailey. Up next is Bailey. I gotta go. We will be checking both sides of your face for a mark. Is that okay? <laughs> yep, that's fine with me. Okay, left and right. Um, not that fast. Go a little slower. Okay, you're good. Okay, great, bye. Wait, we need you to take off the makeup. Uh, what? Why? We just have to make sure you don't have a mark. I can't, I'm insecure. Take the makeup off or we'll take it off for you. Okay. Did you take off the makeup for us? Yes. Okay, then remove your hand. Mmm, it's stuck, I can't. Just do it. Okay. Ha! I knew it! Criminals are always lying to everyone. I am not a liar. Come with us now, we're going out this way. But then I have to walk past the entire line of people. Maybe you shouldn't have lied about your mark then. Oh, Bailey, you're back! And you have a red mark? Yeah. So you lied to all of us? It's not like that, I swear. No, it is. I can't be friends with a criminal. Hey, wait. Weren't you the girl that I just ran into in the line? Oh, yeah, I am. How come there's nobody else in here but us? Imagine we're the only two criminals. Right, that's funny. You two are the only criminals this year. You will be working together. What? Oh. What do you mean we're the only two? I cannot be left in charge of anything. Usually there's more than that. Ever committed a crime? No. Uh, I haven't either. How were you two even selected then? I don't know, don't ask me. Whatever, you're gonna need to be more intimidating. Why are you making that face? Oh, I thought that was a mean face. Literally never do that again. Just go change into something else. Okay, no need to shout. Okay, that's slightly better. Act more mean, you're too approachable. I can't, I'm not mean. Everyone's a little bit mean. My friends call me a golden retriever. Can't we be nice criminals? Fine, but there's one thing I need to tell you guys. What? Every year you have to kill two people as a criminal. Yo, am I hearing that right? If you don't kill two people, they'll take your life instead. No, I can't do this. A million dollars or a ring? <laughs> Obviously I'm gonna choose the million dollars. Have you seen my shirt? Oh. You did not just do that. Oh shit, were you making your decision? Now I have a useless ring. I could have been a millionaire. <laughs> My bad. I don't even like the color green. Who needs a million dollars, right? Literally, I wish I was an only child. Bailey, I need to tell you something. Hmm? I was the reason you and your boyfriend broke up last year. What? Why are you just telling me this now? I don't know, but he cheated on you five times. The only reason that you're passing this class is because you are so hot. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's disgusting. I, I gotta go, gotta blast. How's it going with that ring? I think it makes people tell me the truth. Wait, that's so cool. Mm -hmm. We're actually not related. We found you in a basket on our porch and you were an ugly baby, so we felt bad. What? You fucking bitch. Three, Three two, two, 
won! Happy birthday! Thanks, Mom. I got you this special necklace. It's beautiful. I love it. No matter what happens, never take it off. Never? Don't ask questions, okay? Okay, I won't. Happy 18th, Bailey. Thanks, guys. I love that necklace. Oh, thanks. My mom gave it to me. So, could I try it on? Uh, no, sorry. What? Why not? I can't. She told me not to take it off. Oh, okay. Want to come to mine after school? Yeah, sure. Cool. Meet me here at four. Okay. Wow, uh, your house is really dark. Oh, yeah, um, our power went out. Oh, okay. I brought you some water. Thanks. <laughs> what happened? Good morning. Where's my necklace? Your necklace is mine now. I'm royalty, not you. What? Royalty? What are you on? That was a gift from my mom. Whoever wears that necklace will be the next one to rule. And I have it. Am I being pranked? No, but you might as well be because you're easy to trick. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? Because you don't actually have my necklace. What? I'm literally <laughs> holding it. You really think I didn't suspect you? No, I, I thought you were stupid. You asked to try it on four times. Of course I know what my own necklace means. Well, it doesn't matter because I have it. Or do you? How did you give it? Uh-uh, not so fast. You have a decoy. Now, if you don't mind, I gotta get out of here. Hey, wait a minute. Who are you? I'm her stepbrother, Liam. Don't bother trying to stop me. I'm not gonna try to stop you. I just need your help. I don't even know you. I didn't want to start with this, but I'm a prince. You're a what? Oh, please, you know that's not true. Hey, you guys want to play Truth or Dare? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm down too. Okay, Cody, Truth or Dare? Uh, Dare. I dare you to kiss Lacey. Guys, what the fuck? No. Oh, come on. Have a little fun. You're not kissing him. He's my boyfriend. Yeah, you want to bet? See, no harm done. No, that's enough of this game for me. I'm leaving. Bailey, wait. What? Why are you being like this? Why would you do that? You knew it was going to make me mad. It's just a game. It doesn't mean anything. Whatever. Why won't this door open? Maggie, can you please unlock the door? What do you mean? The front door is not locked. Yes, it is. It won't open. What the fuck? None of the doors or windows will open. How would everything be locked? I didn't do it. Yo, what? It just, it won't open. That doesn't make any sense. Who wants to play a game? Guys, that's not funny. Who turned out the lights? Don't look at me. I didn't do it. Since you all think it's fun to play games, let's go for a couple rounds of Dare or Dare. Dude, are we being pranked right now? Wyatt, I dare you to pull out all your eyelashes. Bro, what? That's crazy. No. Don't do it. Someone's just messing with us. Are you sure? Ah! Um, is he dead? Bitch, he definitely does not look alive to me. Now that you all know I'm not kidding, let's continue with the game. Lacey, I dare you to tell everyone the truth. What is he talking about? Um, I was trying to sabotage your relationship with your boyfriend on purpose because I want him. You what? You're supposed to be my best friend. I don't want to be your friend anymore. Bailey, it's your turn for a little fun. I dare you to tell everyone how you really met your boyfriend. What is he talking about? I thought you guys met on Tinder. Uh, that's a good question. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Well, spit it out then. I stole him from my mom. What? Oh. Huh. Bitch, that's so weird. Uh, well, they were dating, but he's too young for her anyway. So you're just a homewrecker. Enough. Mary, I dare you to shave all of your hair off. No way, I cannot shave my head. I would be so ugly. Really, bitch? That's your final straw? Bailey, can you chill? What? We're already stuck in here, so you might as well be nice. Fine, whatever. Just do it, and you can have a cute little Britney Spears moment. Fine, I'll do it. You see, that's just not good enough. What? But she did it. Not all the way. Jack, I dare you to jump from the windowsill. No. Today's the day. Are you finally ready? Yeah, I just hope that it's a lot. The whole family has thousands. You're fine. Okay. 
Okay, three, two, one. Oh. Two? That's the lowest we've ever had. <sighs> this sucks. Well, I have to warn you about something. What could be worse? People with really low vibes are always captured. You have to draw another number on your neck or else. Okay, I'll draw another number. Please be careful at school for me. I will. Ah! Whee! What is happening? Oh, yeah, um, everybody's jumping off the top of the school right now. Oh. We're about to go up there right now. Do you want to join us? You know, I'm good. I'll stay here. Psst. Psst. Hello? I know that you have a low amount of lives, but don't uh worry. I do too. I have an order for stupid hoe. Miss, I think this is your order. Excuse me? I mean, that's your name, stupid hoe. <laughs> so, are you gonna take your food? Yeah, I guess that is me. Do y'all see my nickname today? Yeah, that's so tragic. Bitch, I have a job interview. Oh, that's even worse. Ugh. I mean, it's not that bad. Out of all of the names I could have gotten today, they chose this? I'm sorry, but good luck at your interview. Whatever. Thank you. Hi, I'm here for my interview. Okay, stupid hoe. You can have a seat in the waiting room. Mr. Red can see you now. Okay. Oh, hello. Hi. <laughs> Are you ready to get started? Yeah, I'm ready. I, uh, I like your nickname. I know, it's bad. So is yours. I don't know what I did to deserve Mega Slut, but, uh, you're hired. Wait, I'm hired? Yeah, you got the job. Just, just like that? Yep, you can start tomorrow. Okay, sweet. One thing, though, you won't be an assistant. You'll be the face of our company. You want me to be the face of your company? We just didn't mention it, but I think you'd be perfect. So, what do you say? It'll be fun, I swear. You know what? I'm feeling brave today. Sure. Great, just be over here tomorrow at 7 a.m. sharp. Yeah, I'll be back here at 7. Okay, it has to be better today, right? That's worse. I can't say that one out loud. Yeah, I know, it's still bad. Don't worry, I got raging whore. What is wrong with our nicknames? I have no idea. Aw, you two are so cute. What are you talking about? Your nicknames match. You know that means you're soulmates, right? What? Please be a long time. I really want to stare at Josh in fourth period. What? What am I supposed to do if I can't see the whole day? Hey, what do you think of this shirt I'm wearing? Uh, nothing, since I only got four minutes to see today. Um, Bailey, I'm to your right. Oh. Am I gonna have to drive to school today? No, bitch, I'll drive. You can't see. Right. <laughs> um, you're in my seat. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know. You're not even looking at me. Shouldn't you check before you sit down? I literally can't see anything. Well, then feel around or something. I don't know. Damn. Don't worry, Stacy. This will teach her. Who did that? Y'all are assholes. She did not deserve that. Thank you. I'm over here. Sorry. Oh, wow. <clears throat> uh, you're really beautiful. I hope a lot of people like him, too. Then he can hang out with all of my friends. Oh. What did you even do to get that many people to hate you? Wow. No one hates my soulmate. How cool is that? Yeah, that's great. Right? What about you? Oh, I gotta go to class. Bye. Wait, why are you running away from me? I'm not. I just am worried about the test. What test? The one about shapes. No. Girl, tell me what's going on right now. I think a lot of people hate my soulmate. What? But you're so nice. How could you get a bad soulmate? I don't know, but it's like a lot. How many people is a lot? 3,000. What? What if you like committed a crime or something? I sincerely doubt that. No way. What? That guy over there. Okay, what about him? He's the one who got the principal fired. Okay, that feels a little personal. Morning, sis. Oh, hey. I made some pancakes. Ugh. Are you okay? No, I'm good. Just stub my toe. 
There is no way he's not doing this on purpose. My soulmate literally hates children. How weird is that? I mean, that's kind of bad, but I think my soulmate hates me. What are you talking about? That's not even possible. He's picking things that literally directly relate to me. He doesn't even know who you are. You're tripping. I don't think I am. Then how would he know anything about you? I don't know, but he does. Again. You should try leaving your hair a natural color. And you should really try using deodorant. You stink. Damn, so you're just gonna act feral like that? Yeah, when you come at me sideways. Well, I'm just saying, I don't like pink hair. And I'm telling you, I don't care. Hey, yo, good morning, pink hair. What's up? That is not my name. Honestly, I don't remember your real name. Do you always do your makeup like that? Um, yeah, why? Maybe you should try something, like, natural. And you should try closing your mouth, because nothing good is coming out of it. How tall are you? Why so many questions? I'm just curious. I'm 5'3". <laughs> Short ass bitch. Also, your necklace is ugly. I cannot stand you. Alright, I gotta get going. Okay, why are you telling me? I really don't care. Please, go. Damn, fine then. There you are. So? So what? So, is there any more news about your soulmate? Now it says that he hates love. That's kind of worse than hating kids. Yeah. Do you have any idea of who it could be? Unfortunately, I think I may have one. As long as it wasn't that guy you were talking to. I like him. No? You can do this, Bailey. I'm sure it can't be that bad. Not her. She's the only one I have left. Good morning, little sis. I brought you some breakfast so you can have it in your bed. You love pancakes. Where's the excitement today? I wish you were never born. What? How could you say that? Seriously? Get out of my room. Fine, whatever. You're such a brat. Nothing could be worse than that. And I was proven wrong. Jesse, I need to tell you something. Yeah, go ahead. You know Matt? Matt as in my crush mm -hmm. Matt? I slept with him. Bailey, what? Why would you do that to me? I'm so sorry. I can't. Literally get out of my face. I don't want to talk to you at all right now. Okay. Can this be over now? What? Good morning, sis. I love your hair. Um, thanks. I have bed head. No, I mean the color of it. The color? What are you talking about? Have you not looked in the mirror today? No. You might want to. <gasps> Why am I literally Barney the fucking dinosaur? It must be your soulmate's favorite color. What? Your hair changes when you're going to meet him. Oh, great. His favorite color is bright purple. Bailey, why are you hiding from us? We know it's you. Whoa. <laughs> Your hair is so purple. Please just don't bring it up. Hey, Bailey. Oh, hey, Mike. I love your new hair. Really? Purple looks nice on you. Thanks. Purple is actually uh, my favorite color. Oh, would you look at the time? I have to go. Bye. Why would you run away? He's so sweet. My soulmate cannot be him. He's my best friend. Girl, you can't just keep running away from him forever. Yes, I can. He's your best friend. How will that work? I'll just make up an excuse when I see him. You're a terrible liar, though. Rude. Hey, Bailey, wait up. Oh, sorry, that was the bell. Why are you running from me? I'm not. Is something going on? No. Seriously, I gotta go. Wait, I have a question. What? What's your favorite color? Um, red. Really? I could have sworn that it was blue. Yeah, sorry. You can't keep lying to him like that. I know. Why would you say that? Because I don't want him to figure it out. It is definitely him. A lot of people like the color purple. What happened to Mike's hair? What? Yo, my hair's red! Oh no. Isn't that the same color you told him? It is. Please, just don't be anything weird. Are you actually kidding me? Good morning! Oh, um, your nickname is Barney? I wonder why. Oh, it could be because you have purple hair, but like, I don't know. Good one, obviously. But how would he know that you have purple hair? I wish I knew. <laughs>
Your nickname is Sweetheart? Cute, right? And yours is Barney? Thanks. Like the dinosaur? That's embarrassing. You're embarrassing. Hey, purple hair. Purple hair, can you hear me? Ryan, you know that's not my name. Yeah, but your actual name annoys me, so... Ugh. You should really dye your hair back to a normal color. Why? Because I hate purple. Who hates the color purple? You know, can you just, like, go away? No, where would I go? I've been sitting here. I don't know, go sit next to the trash or something. You're the only person who has a nickname that actually suits them. My soulmate bought me a new car. Are you kidding me? That's so cool. My soulmate hasn't said anything. I'm sorry. Oh, I guess I spoke too soon. Is that? He did not. So does he want you to wear them, or? I don't know, but that's the first thing he had to send me. It's kind of romantic. Yeah, real good first impression. Maybe he's just kidding. Ah! Oh, you love sugar free. Yeah, except that it's open and empty. Oh. Uh, maybe he just got thirsty. He's giving me the worst things he can find. Okay, they're not that bad. I haven't even met him and I'm already over him. Oh good, now he's trying to tell me that I smell. That's a nice gift. I know, I'm just kidding. I've been trying to piss off my soulmate all day. I sent an empty can. Um, don't you hate him? Yeah, I do. So, what are you gonna do? What do you mean? Like, how are you gonna tell him it's you? Girl, I'm not telling him. What if he's actually your soulmate? The chances of him actually being my soulmate are slim to none. Me and that dinglebat have nothing in common. Tell that to the empty can that hit your head. Whatever. I'm sure it's just a coincidence. Whatever floats your oh. boat. Finally, something sensible. Maybe he wants you to put it on so he can find you. No way, I'm not wearing it. Girl, why not? If it is him, I don't want him to know. So I'm gonna put it in my pocket and pretend like I don't have it. The test is starting soon. No, no, no! Why are you yelling? I'm trying to study. I just sent my soulmate the wrong gift. Okay, and? I accidentally sent her the bracelet my sister gave me before she passed away. Yeah, you should probably find that. Don't you have that bracelet? Shh, keep her voice down. If it's the one you have, you need to give it back. Well, no, duh, but how do I give it back without revealing my identity? Have you started to gift him yet? No. Okay, you can just send it back to him as a gift then. You know what? You do have good ideas sometimes. Hey, yeah. Uh, sorry. Okay, I have it. You can't send it back first. Why not? He's gonna know you hurt him. Fine. I'll give him this scrunchie first. So am I just supposed to like throw it at him or- No! Oh, too late. Girl, you are so lucky that you have bad aim. Hey, ya! Uh, just send him the bracelet and don't throw it. Okay, my bad. <gasps> my soulmate sent me back the bracelet! That was easy. See, no harm done. She must have heard me say it. That means she goes to this school. Thought maybe some harm was done. Maybe you should just send him something that'll throw him off. Like what? Um, like a fake ID or a passport. Girl, a fake ID has a photo and a name on it. Okay, scrap that idea. Yeah, something else. If he wants to send you bad gifts, maybe you should send bad ones back. You know what? I like where this is headed. Oh, I know. I can send him this sock. Really? A sock? You're no fun. Where's the other one? Uh, no, I'm only going to send him one of them. Why did my soulmate send me a single sock? Better be careful. I am careful. Remember when I got hit in the head with a can? Yeah, that was funny. I think it's time for payback. Oh, what the fuck? You better hope no one saw you drinking that earlier. He won't know. I swear I saw this can earlier today. Uh-oh. You didn't think to switch the can? No, I didn't think. Hey, Bailey, what's going <laughs> on? Uh, nothing. <laughs> I'm just hanging out. Why are you acting suspicious then? I'm not. I've never acted suspicious in my life. Do you drink energy drinks? Uh, no, <laughs> I don't. You're holding one. It's hers. Okay, well, if you see anyone holding a bang, let me know. Yep, I'll let you know. <laughs> Do you think he knows? He might. You're a bad actor. Shit. I told you you needed to be careful. 
I thought I was careful. Not enough. A $500 gift card? What? I didn't send him that. Are you positive? Yes, I'm sure. Everyone, I found my soulmate. It's Macy. How is that possible? It's not. Macy can't be his soulmate. I'm his soulmate. You don't even want to be his soulmate. Yeah, well, I don't want someone else to be his soulmate. Hey, purple-haired bitch, you better stay away from my man, all right? I'm sorry? Hey, normal. Oh, phew. So, is your soulmate dangerous or not? Nope, says he has a zero. Okay, good. That would be so bad if he was. Yeah, I know. If the number goes up at all, even one, tell me right away. Yep, yeah, I will. I have to go to work. Uh, bye. I can take whoever's next. Oh, hey. Hi. What can I get for you? Uh, your phone number. I'm sorry? Sorry, may have come on a little too strong there. Um, no, it's fine here. I'll just have a large latte. Yeah, yeah, coming right up. Order for Joe. Thanks, beautiful. I'll call you. See ya. You know, I think that he may have been flirting with you. Yeah, he definitely was. Oh, how cute. Whatever. Has his danger level gone up at all? No. <laughs> then why did you say it like that? Like what? You just seem a little off. <laughs> Are you okay? No, I'm fine. Okay, I have to go to work now. Bailey, someone's asking for a manager up front. I'm on my break, really? It's the guy from yesterday. Oh. <laughs> Look at my drink. Something is wrong with it. Uh, what's wrong with it? It looks fine to me. It's just that you're not the one who made it for me. Oh. I mean, you never texted me, so... If I do, will you be the one who's making my drink? Maybe. Okay, how about this? Let's go on a date tonight. I'll pick you up at 7. Sure, I'm not doing anything better. Well, don't say it like that. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. I'll see you tonight, beautiful. See ya. <laughs> Miss, you need to be really careful of him. Mm, sorry? He was my stalker for like four years. He was obsessed with me. What? Girl, I'm just trying to warn you. He is dangerous. Honestly, I think I can fend for myself. Sorry. Okay, what happens if it turns out that she's telling the truth? I don't even know her. She could be making that up. So you'd rather trust a random guy? He was cute. It's fine. Be safe on your date, but good luck. Thanks. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, I didn't send in my address. He said, I'm here. But I didn't tell him where I live. Whatever. He probably just Googled it. You should get some new blinds for your bedroom window. I can see in there. Uh, I'm sorry? I'm just letting you know. There's some creepy people out there. Okay, <laughs> let's go to the restaurant. Where are we going? Uh, it's a surprise. It's going to be great. Don't worry. Okay. This doesn't look like a restaurant. This is a basement. Yeah, it's my basement and you're mine now. What? Please give me invisibility. I look like a rat's ass today. Persuasion. Hey, sis. Don't you dare ask me. Yeah, can you drive me to school today? No, I already told you, you embarrass me. You will. Okay, yeah, hop in. Cool. And that's why you can't get it up. You two are fighting again? Oh, when are we not? You should just be in love again. It was so much better that way. I love you so much, honey. Fuck the divorce. Hmm, <laughs> I like this. <laughs> you need to see me after class. You got a 69%. No, I didn't. I got 100%. Wait, what? Did you really? I did. I must have read it wrong. It's a hundred. Aaron! What's up, slut? We should go on a date. Ew, fuck no. You will take me on a date. I would rather jump off a cliff. What? I want you to take me on a date. And I want to be happy, but we can't all have what we want. Crap. Come on, please give me something good. All? What is all? Bailey, guess what? What's up? My gift is mind reading. That's so much cooler than mine. What am I thinking? I wish this stupid bitch would stop talking to me. What do you mean? It's not working on you. Guys, you're gonna be late. We'll figure it out later. Prom tickets are five dollars. Do you think you're gonna go? Probably not. I'm not gonna be able to find a date. I'll be your date. No, no, let me. Me. What? 
Looks like you won't have a problem finding a date. Yeah, I guess not. I've been in love with you ever since the first day you sat down. Ew, you're my teacher. What? I didn't even say anything. Yes, you did. Jenna, try to use your power on me. Uh, why? Do it. I can see people's biggest fears, but nothing comes up for you. I think th You need to come with us right now. Okay, honestly, I'll be happy with like a six. That's average. Mm -hmm. yeah. Two. I mean, I know I'm not Gigi Hadid, but a two? Rude. I am so relieved that I got an eight as my score. How did you get an eight? You're my twin sister. Apparently, I got the better genes. Ugh. This system is rigged. Or maybe you're just ugly. Hmm. Bailey, you can't sit here. What are you talking about? You have to at least be a seven to sit here. That's not a thing. Um, it is a thing, so get up. No, I always sit here. And I'm telling you, you can't anymore. Okay, now get up. I might be a two, but at least I'm not ugly on the inside. You can't fix that. Literally, whatever. Hey, um, I like your hair. Why are you talking to me? You're a 10. Okay, uh, aren't you a 10 too? I'm not. Well, uh, I think that you're a 10 either way. What? Oh, shut up. Hey, hey, do you guys want to play spin the bottle? Yeah. Yes? Yeah, I'm down. Yo, what if someone can find their soulmate this way? No offense, but I don't want anyone here to be my soulmate. I'm taking that personally. <laughs> oh, it landed on Macy. Ooh. Well, do it then. <laughs> Is something wrong? No, sorry, I just thought I saw a fly. <laughs> Bailey? Bailey? What? Your turn. Yeah, yeah, I'll spin it. I hope it lands on me. Okay, it landed on Jackson. Great. Yo. Aw, cute. Wait, Bailey, can I talk to you for a sec? Yeah, of course. I think that we're soulmates. What? Kiss me, right now. We, no, we can't do that. We're best friends. We have to find out if it's true or not. We could be soulmates. No. How is he making out with Macy? He literally just told me he liked me five minutes ago. Maybe he moves on fast. No, I know him too well. He's trying to make me jealous. Well, is it working? No, of course it's not working. Are you sure that you don't like him? Well, like I don't, but at the same time... Girl, you are just in denial. Why don't you just go tell him? Because I don't want to make it weird. It's not weird. We've been best friends since, like, the fourth grade. Oh, that's a little weird. <laughs> so you're just going to sit here and let him do that to you? I'm not going to tell him. I'll just, like, find another soulmate. That's actually just not possible. So you need a pusher. Ugh, fine, I'll talk to him. Mm. Oh, yeah. yeah, feel free. Stop at any time. Um, a word? Oh, sure. Thanks. Just to clear the air, Macy is my girlfriend. Your... your girlfriend? Yep. Morning, sis! Why do you look so happy? Uh, I am happy. <sighs> what is it about this time? I don't know, I'm just like excited to meet my soulmate, I guess. I don't think I've ever seen you in a bad mood. What emotion is he feeling? He's been mad ever since it showed up. Weird, I wonder what it could be. He has to get over it eventually, right? He might just be the opposite of you. Oh, I need to leave. Um, I'll see you later, though. Of course. Okay, cool. We only have two volunteers this year. Is Bailey here? Hi, that's me. Okay, and then the other volunteer today is Tate. Fuck off. Did you just curse at me around children? Um, yeah, I did. And what about it? Okay, bad first impression. Could you just leave me alone? Not really. We're the only two volunteers that came. Are you kidding me? I'm stuck with you. Mm -hmm. Why are you so grumpy? Where's your holiday spirit? I hate the holiday season, and happiness is for suckers. Jeez. Girl, I am so nervous. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I have so much anxiety. Just don't stress about it. You'll be fine. Okay, okay. Are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay, three, two, one. Is this a prank? Mine's not that bad. What's yours? I'll tell you after I do it, okay? Bailey, hey, I'm surprised to see you here. Hey. Just give me the next stare. <sighs> These are not getting any better. Mom, I love you so much. 
Um, I love you too. Just remember that right now, okay? I love you. Wh what are you doing? No. I'm sorry. You broke my nose. No, I'm so sorry. Do I really want to meet my soulmate this badly? Am I am I seeing that correctly? All right, Jermaine. What?